Hey guys, it's Rob again. I've got kale. Now kale is one of those tough, tough crops. So we can get you a close up of what we got going on here. Beautiful crop of kale. We've had some cool nights, nothing too severe. But kale is your cold weather champion. I had some kohlrabi this year. I had some monster kohlrabi. It is also a cold weather champion. But I'm very interested to see how far I can take the kale. And kale's supposed to be the cold weather champion. We are about to find out. And these are the big lima beans I grew this year that didn't really... This is a more of a warmer weather climate. We did get a little bean. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'll back up a little bit. It's a little bit blurry. There's some focus. It's not much. Not what we're expecting. A lot more than that, but... And the sweet potato that I had down here, I'll tell you what happened to that. I had, I had little stringy potatoes. Not warm enough here in Canada. Well, by golly, this looks like charred. Yep. <laughs> we cleaned out the garden, as you can see. It was a hell of a mess this year. Didn't really take good care of it, and I apologize to everybody around that. Uh, our pepper plant. Here's our two-year-old pepper plant, guys. Look at that beautiful pepper. You can see that. We're going to pull that. There's our harvested pepper. Sorry about the... There. You might find that to be a little bit easier to deal with. So anyway, that's our two-year-old pepper plant that, in my opinion, cannot be salvaged any further. They do say two years is maximum. You can see I have another pepper here, but it's been packed away at different critters and slugs and you name it. Rub out. <laughs>